Good afternoon, friends. This is Sergey Kromchenko from Los Angeles, California. I currently work as an engineering manager of SDAT. I've been into QA for more than eight years, but today we're going to talk about self-education versus taking a course if you would like to become a quality assurance engineer. But before I jump straight into it, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and please give me a big fat thumb up if you like the content. That's the only way YouTube will rank up my videos so you and our people could see them. Let's make it happen. So a few people lately asked me a question. Can you educate yourself and get a job in a QA without getting a course? So there is a simple answer. Yes, it's possible, but it's very time consuming. By knowing all the information that you need to get in order to get a job, I can definitely assure you it will be quite challenging, but I'm gonna give you four tips that you need to know if you are planning to educate yourself, which are the most important things. So the first one and the most important one, uh, you need to create a plan of education. And uh, it might be challenging to find, infor I mean, it will likely be challenging to find all the information that you need to know when you don't know it. Uh, the second one is you need to find the right information in the internet. So internet is full of a lot of information. As you know, some of it misleading, some of it not. Uh, so you need to know where and how to find uh, the right information for your course. Uh, third one, you need to get experience so you would be able to talk about it during interview. Uh, just a quick tip, whenever you go for an interview, the first thing they always ask you is about your experience. Uh, and if you do not have it, you, you, you'd have to come up with something. Uh, fourth one, uh, how do you know if you did the job in the right way or not? That's quite a good question when you're doing self-education because if you have no one to tell you, okay, that's not right and this is how you should do it, uh, that it will be challenging to go for an interview because you will go through a lot of failures until you will possibly find out that you didn't do it right correctly. Uh, and the fifth one, interview preparation. This one is one of the most important ones because whenever you want to get a job, you always have to go for an interview. You always have to talk about your experience. You always have to answer tens or sometimes even hundreds of questions uh, to be able to get a job. But on the other side, you can take a course which will solve all these problems we just described above, which will give you a well-structured educational plan uh, which will give you all the information you need to know, which was already verified by people with a lot of experience, then you will also not make mistakes. And if you will, you will be corrected by your leaders or managers or teachers. And then fourthly, what was it? Uh, experience. You will be able to get a real experience because you will be working on a real project. And fifth, and the latest and the most important one, you will get an interview preparation uh, part of the course, which will fully prepare you for an interview. People will train you to answer questions in the best way so you would be able to get a job as quickly as possible. And lastly, you will get a mentor, the person who've done it multiple times, the person who worked in multiple companies, the person who will be able to answer all of your questions. Even if you have finished your course and you want to and you got a job and you want to grow, you want to make more money, you want to become a manager or a director, you can still ask your mentor and that person will help you out. So now you should be able to make a decision if you want to go with the self-education or take a course. And by the way, if you do want to self-educate yourself in the next video, I'm going to give you a detailed list of things you need to learn just so you wouldn't have to go throughout the internet and look for them. If you want to join us, feel free to hit the link below and register for the course, which starts August 31st. We still have two spots available, but otherwise, thank you for joining us. Don't forget to give me a big fat thumb up, subscribe to our channel, and I will see you guys in the next video.